Hi folks and welcome back to Bloodstained! The beta backer demo. No, we only got through half of this, but we thought we'd better play it, especially considering... Uh, well, yeah, well we, we, you, it's been quite a while, so you may not remember, but we got to the boss at the end of the ship, which is the starting area, and, it came and then we lost to him. We both lost to him. Yeah. Fact, or her, rather. Very, actually, thinking about it, she's very obviously a, a her, if you get what I'm saying. I can't um, remember. Gone. She's very obvious. Yeah, yeah, okay, her. yeah, I get what, I can't remember what the yeah. boss was like. Uh, it's a lot, but, but yeah, the game like, is coming out soon, yeah. the full game. Yeah, but uh, anyway, so after the, after that, I went back, and I think this might be the file we, we played on back then. It's the one that's... Uh, it's, it's the one that's in the first slot. But obviously, I, I went back, uh, and obviously there was more of the game afterwards, after yeah. that boss. Hence by the uh, 12 hours of playtime you've got yeah. there. Well, that was mostly me grinding for specific items. You know the shards you get? Yeah. The, the, the weapon. You can upgrade them. Oh, fair enough. But they require specific items. Bloodstain, Ritual of the Night. Controls, shown on something that I'm do, not using. Do, 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 do. Simon, Simon's room, if anybody yeah. doesn't get it. Do, 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 do. There we go. Yeah, you're only you're uh, when you can uh, kill hordes of the undead with a whip. You've officially got you've not got a whip, have you? Oh, I do have a whip. Oh. This is just stronger. Look at my equipment right now. Oh, I've also got a gun, oh, yeah. which is terrible. Even if I have actually have a uh, ammo equip. Uh, also, I've heard that I uh, after that I heard about certain glitches. Okay. Which allow you to get to areas you shouldn't be able to get to. What is in the room? Areas of the demo or areas at all? Areas of the demo. Yeah. yeah. For a second there, I thought you did, but then I forgot. It's more like it's not like something of the night. It's more like uh, Dawn of Sorrow. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway, so hence why when we played. Uh, Guess the moon. Uh, yeah. I think he was like, "Oh, you're a shard binder." Blah blah blah. We still haven't got the good ending on that. Yeah. Anyway, so what I want to do is that. Oh. See, I I think what you, I think in the main game, assuming all the areas are, you know, the same sort of layout, you're supposed to be able to get like a double jump, and then you have to come back here, double jump over. Well, f from oh. your guys' viewpoint, it's to do, but instead. I can glitch over here and go fuck you and get the critical ring. Wait a minute. So he's e even main game stuff in the depth, but not in the demo. Yeah. Uh, if I go, well, I'll just kill this guy again. <coughs> Imagine oh, we didn't golem drop from any loot. Golem from Dark Cloud, that guy. Yeah. But you see, if I zoom in. <laughs> With that same glitch, I can get to uh, that section on the far left. Oh yeah. Except there's not actually anything up there. Oh, I see. Well, I can get to the left and middle section of that section that I haven't been in. Yeah. Well, there's nothing in either of those. I can't get into the bit on the right because there's a locked door. Oh, I see. Likewise, the empty space in the middle section. Yeah. And there's a separate glitch which I can't do. Because I can't figure out the, there's a list of instructions and I can't figure it out. Fair enough. For getting to that other blank spot there. Okay. On the bottom. But anyway, let me just go heal up because I got hit a few times. And let's have a boss battle. Let's hope this time yeah. we don't suck. So cutscene happens. Oh yeah, of course. And we see Gebel. Or Jebel, or... Alucard. You decided... Tell me you didn't do this. It doesn't make any sense. Yeah, in the demo, he's Alucard. In this, he's actually just evil. Oh. In, not in the demo, in the uh, yeah, in, in but, Curse of the Moon. Curse of the Moon. Yeah. Like I said, in the good, there's a, there's a very a bit of a and the, and the good ending of Curse of the Moon. You know when you do the the game again, there's mm. a, a very distinct ending 
Which uh, would surprise you, I think. Fuck no. I'm calling it, uh, what, what's his name? A shaft uh, kind of thing from from uh, Sint of the Night. Mm. You know where Shaft overtakes Richter? Mm. I'm calling that. Release the Kraken. Here's Mrs. Tentacle Monster. Okay, I definitely don't remember that this. I've been the God of War bosses, these kind of bosses. Even though I've never played God of War. Really? Yes. You remember how this was kicking our asses last time? Yeah. Yeah. We even a lot of practice to be. Now, you were oh, only yeah. level 5. Hmm? And then I get a shard. <coughs> There's only, I think, 3 shards in the game that you can't upgrade, and this is one of them. Anyway. Called it! And then... Stage clear! Pretty much, yeah. And then we bring the ship into park. Hey look, it's Castlevania. Yeah. Well, it's not Castlevania, but... Is it, is it Castle or is it called Castlevania? Oh, in Castlevania? Yeah. I believe so, yes. It's, well, always, it's, Dracula's it's, Castle. it's often known as Dracula's Castle, but I've also heard it being called Dra Castlevania. Because in some of the, the, the law tones, it says Castlevania has risen again. Mm. Yeah. Uh, one thing I don't get about the depth, get in the, in this. Right, see? How the ship is very clearly parked. Yeah, you can still go inside. Oh, you can still go inside. And then uh, when you go inside. Okay. You see the problem? Yeah, we're, we're apparently at sea. Yes. No, we're not. <laughs> exactly. Anyway, so. I went to Yeah, those guys don't drop shards. We haven't got a lot of money. Oh, maybe we do. Am I going to see uh, big wolf dogs from... What, the giant rat? Yeah, I thought it was a giant dog from... No, the, 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 we, get, we see the dogs later on. I say that's from... Uh, uh, yeah, we've got, actually we've got quite a bit of gold. Yeah, I, I was looking at the bottom thing when you know when you just gain 10 gold, up. yeah. yeah. Uh, I don't like Kingdom Hearts. What the hell? Literally just kick it to death.
Oh, the church sent me, as I can, as we can tell by your massive sleeves. Um, what, what? I kind of want to make an honest and joke here. Well, by the, because is it because she's blonde? One because she said the church. One because she's blonde, and one demons. Yes. Do you think you've got it at all? We've all spent lucky charms everywhere. Yes. An exorcist. <laughs> <coughs> Dominic. Johannes. Uh, I think Cage's playing in his cage. I can hear someone playing in the cage. Uh, one of the girls is drinking. Can't see which one from here. Uh, she deserves to be armed with all the facts. Where are you at? He summoned the castle. Not the church. Yes, just like ignore this chest. Oh, there's a good chest there. No, I don't need it. This place seems secure. Oh, the classic. Yeah, um, we need you to do this, but we're too lazy to go ourselves, so. Yeah. One, th one, thing shoo. I, yeah. one thing I've just realized, though, is. You know the the, uh, the the shard system is very similar to the soul system from uh, Dawn of Sorrow. Yeah. The layout is also similar. Of, of, of the you know wh who's where. Yeah. Don't be foolish. Although that technically they're both the shopkeeper. Okay. Human transmutation. It is the key to our evolution. No way. <laughs> See, in Skyrim, you just go, oh, let's get this, for instance, eyeball or this tiger's claw. Let's just shook them all together. And then you get a potion. Yeah, or, as I found, eating several of these things tells you what, to what uh, the, yeah. the uh, effects do. Which was <coughs> really, really, really upsetting when I had to eat, I think it was a, it was a saber tooth tiger's eye, and like, I want to find out what this does, but I have to eat an eye. Mm. Yeah. So let's go see Johannes. Oh, you put them in the church? That's what the. No, this the, this is what the church got for us. Oh, I'm not sure this town ha actually has a church. I was gonna say you put the little girl in the church. So that's not a good idea. No, you left her with you left her with the person who works with the, for the church. That's even yeah. worse. Mutate new items. 
I have some materials we can use. So let's try transmuting them. So we get a bat feather and a melting bone. Oh, so it, it, it is basically the synthesis of Final Fantasy, kind of. Yeah, so like bat feather and melting bone make potion, monster bird tier and, oh, and except two you potions have all the make recipes. a big potion. Oh, you have yeah. all the recipes. Oh. Exactly. And there's also a sort of weapon upgrade system. So if you start off with the short sword, yeah. you can upgrade it with like end to the long sword, and then with the, all those things... So the even better sword and so on and so on and so on. See, at least this one isn't like Kingdom Hearts where you have to synthesize everything before you get the good stuff. Yeah. For example, the ultimate keyblade. And you have, I, that took me about five, three days. This is the best weapon purely in attack values in the entire game. Okay. It looks, and it looks really cool as well. Then you've got other ones. Poison is a right bitch to find. You know my 12 hour playtime file? Yep. In that entire th time, I have found precisely one. That's all you need, though. I know. Except for the fact there's two things. A part of Oh, of course, the women. Is that partisan poisoned? No. So, in Dark Cloud, the partisan is... Or is it the partisan is a lance? But I'm pretty sure it's it's have the scorpion that evolves into the, from the poison of the partisan. If you have the scorpion evolved from the scorpion to the partisan, it gains poison and critical. Yeah, look at the gun. Yep, you evolve the gun by combining it with, with better HP, ammo. With, with HP better rounds, ammo. HP rounds. Oh my so god, it's the hug gun bullets from uh, Resi Two. Yeah, soft point rounds, hollow point rounds, armor piercing rounds. Oh my god, it's it's the hit hug gun bullets. Yeah. You know the uh, ra uh, ammo powder from uh, Resi Two. Yeah. You know where you like can, can oh, yeah. combined. Oh. This is one. It's one of the. It's one of the best hats in the game. What, as in defense-wise? Def uh, Stat-wise, yeah. Look, oh my god, and it's... Uh, okay. three, four, four, three points higher in defense than the cowboy hat. Two in attack. And one in strength. And the witch's hat just gives you the it same defense as the cowboy hat and more intelligence. Best scarf, best chest plate. The best chest plate requires all the other chest plates to make it. <coughs> anyway, well, we're supposed to be making a potion. I'll go with this. She always says that whenever you make anything. Heard of. And then he usually does something like that. So you we've crafted a potion. Right. Enhanced shard. It's literally the yeah. yeah it's a synthesis set. Yeah. yeah. Kind of see it, yeah. yeah. E each shard is improved by bronze, then steel, bronze, then iron, then steel, and a quantity of something that the creature that you get the shard from drops. Okay. I guess think that's why uh, you can't upgrade the uh, boss one. Yeah, but there's a couple of others that you can't. You can't also can't upgrade for no actual reason. Uh, and you, oh, you can you can dismantle items into the stuff they make. But you need alkahest. Okay. In order to do that, and you can cook food, which gives you permanent stat boosts. Uh, wait, food. The first time you eat them only. Oh. Most of the ingredients you can buy from the other shop. Some of them you can only drop by enemies. Anyway. Okay. Yes. See, how it, see it, it seems a lot. Oh, so it is kind of like the synthesis yes. of Final Fantasy. Yeah, so yeah, I haven't cause... found any formula anywhere in the game right. yet. So. so Final Fantasy, you get so Kingdom Hearts rather the ones. So you start off with three three synthesis, six synthesis items, and when you gather all the stuff to make the make those items, mm. then you unlock the next batch. But yeah. until you synthesize every all of these batches together, and some of them are a pain to get the ingredients for. Like I spent about forty hours. On the, just a synthesis thing alone. Yeah. Get, get grinding to get every single drop, all the enemies, including the new ones, just to finally get to the last page where I can make the three best weapons of the game. And the best part is the best weapon of the game requires all the rare drops from all the. If you bring me the ingredients, I can use alchemy to prepare a meal for us, not cooking alchemy. <laughs> Now the best part about the, uh, the the best weapon is that it requires all tons of five five of the ingredients and the rarest and rarest drops, which is by the new new enemies that you have to get a very specific way. That how they will show up. 
eat, yeah, eating a new food for the first time will give a stat boost. Yeah, we already know that. And on the other side of his room. Nice, isn't it? Yeah. Anyway. Yeah, so. We come here to transform our. Oh, yeah, just destroy half his stuff as well, yeah. Right, just destroy all the purple lanterns wherever you go. I have to light candle space all then. Yeah. Yeah, it's just nearly decapitated. Oh yeah, there's a photo studio. It's nearly decapitated alien woman. Yeah, you know. <coughs> you brain. Oh my god, it's Terrace. Yeah, and. So basically, the same reason you have to buy stuff in Portrait of Ruin. Oh, in any single things. Yeah, but in Portrait of Ruin, the the shopkeep is actually a local friar. Okay. No, the, the the best one I think for me is Dark Cloud. When you get to the final dungeon again, you know the guy was being basically egging you to go on this stuff, then starts selling you stuff. You know, even though you know he knows you need it, instead of giving it for no, you know, like the gems, oh, yeah. he goes, "Oh yeah, I'm gonna charge you a thousand gilder for a gem that you obviously need to power your weapon up because this weapon is the hardest." <laughs> By shard. What? What? How? 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 How does that make sense? Yes, I will take a piece of your soul for some money. Mm. I have many questions and many problems with that. Is trading demon cards even allowed? Of course. The church would soon gather them up and make certain they are purified. I will not be a deceiver. Yes, I will be a deceiver. Oh, I've, I've forgotten that. Buzz the race with everything. It doesn't actually have a gameplay factor as far as I know. Yes. Yeah, it is actually a very useful way of making money. Yes, because she totally doesn't want to use the shards for anything else. Like, yes. No, she can't. Yeah. She doesn't have the special magical power stuffs. Give yeah, me somebody else, mate. Mm. Backstab! Yeah, so. So that we can get some stuff. Like all the base level weapons. <laughs> Hairband. Some other stuff. Alkahest, the universal solvent. For if you want to break stuff down into its parts. And then all these different <sighs> cooking ingredients. Oh, like a dragon egg. Yes. Black pepper, beef. See, the rest of them are okay. I'm a fish. Fr okay, I'm guessing that's not a cooking. Uh, no. Wait, Polycus? Isn't that one of the best? Good or better things? It's an alright axe. Oh, <gasps> Fawn Whip. Yeah. No Dutch. The bunny boots. Oh, God. The crafting recipe for those is ridiculous. You know that hat I was saying about the one yeah. that's the best item? That's one of the three ingredients. Oh wow! Or you can buy it here for twenty thousand. <laughs> HP rounds, flame rounds, ice rounds, thunder rounds, leather and bronze chest guards, hats, scarves, etc. Anyway, we are ready. That's all done. See, I know. I don't think they'll ever be able to get away. With, but I would like if, the, if you know, they, uh, you could, you know, eventually get the recipe for the wit, the the vampire killer whip. Mm. That would be pretty good, pretty dope. Leather chest guard. Which I think is better. No country fe dress. Better defense, anyway. Oh yeah, and there's this person as well. She's very grumpy. Oh, we ran for dear life. Yes, she wants revenge. Those murderers. I'm begging you, help me. It's within my power. Thank you. My mind's strength. What's yours, Miriam? Well, Miriam, I'll gather whatever information I can about the monsters that roamed us. I want you to hunt down the monsters and take vengeance on them. Oh, like the hunting question,
Oh, very like the hunting quests from Gungeon. Oh, sp speaking of which, I've just got to the next level on that. I'm on Shroomers now. See? Oh my god, it actually is! Yeah. Oh, that is awesome. Hunt eight of that monster type. Oh, wait, wait, uh, inventory. Oh, good, we did get the key. Good. Yeah. Um, no, yeah, I'm on the Shroomer quest, and I think then I've got Kill Pillars and then yeah. Dragon. Okay, so let's go do let's go do that quest she sent us on because we won't see that monster further in very much. But conveniently, one spawns right here. One two three How to abuse four, game mechanics five To the ultimate level six Seven. Now, funny was this season, Gungeon. Eight. Yeah. No, my one criticism of the quest system that you know this 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 quest system in this yeah is that you don't get an alert when the quest is finished. Oh, like you're doing Gungeon, where it says yeah, you know, return, yeah, to, yeah, return, return to such yeah, exactly. In this, you have to actually keep count. Oh, did you know there's a comic? And the Gungeon comic. Yeah. Oh, did you also know there's a physical copy of the Armored Armor you can buy? No. Which always goes out of sale pretty quickly. There we go. Avenge death of husband, get high potion. And then you go... Yes! Yeah, of course, the, the other, my other complaint is you can only accept one thing at a time, then you have to... I mean, you can have them all active at once. But, but you, you, have to go, you have to go through this whole got any targets for me thing. So, yes. And then she says, kill them, kill them all, or something like that. See? And then you have to do this again. See? Okay, Flowey! And... Here's what I've turned up on monsters. Yep. <coughs> so... Already doing them all. Yeah. It feels weird not, the, the, not having almost everything die in one hit. Like, you know, because I've been put like, like, yeah, like, on the other one. Oh, yeah, there's one of those guys there. Oh. Oh, look, one there as well. Yeah, I don't remember there being that many of them through here. Oh, hey, hollow point rounds. Nice. Oh, yeah, the, the shard those guys drop is a very familiar one. Is it? Well, for me, to, it's very, very familiar to me. You missed the chest. I know. Which chest were you referring to? That one? Yeah. Yeah, I can't get to that from here. I have to go the long way around. Elf ears. Oh, good. Equip. There. We're They're not going to quit the critical ring. We've got the critical ring equipped. Oh yeah, so we have two accessories, one headgear. There we go. Yes, let's not open the door. Let me just slash it open. Oh, secret! Secret. The lance. Is that a better weapon than what we've got now? Yes, it is. Good. It's also what. Um, Thingy thing had from uh, Castlevania on the, the Mega Drive, Bloodlines. Yeah. What uh, thingy had a wit? One I can't remember the uh, I can't remember the actual names. I know they were Belmonts, mm -hmm. but they were uh, like a branch of the Belmont clan. Uh, one of them had a whip, and the other one had a spear, a lance like that. Yeah. Anyway, so we go along. <coughs> <coughs> That was my first Castlevania game I ever played as well. Yeah. There's doors like this all over the place and they're really annoying. Well, okay, so what move? Yeah. Anyway, here's the entrance to the castle. Really, we should have come along... That bit. See the gap? Yeah. Yeah. But... Oh, well, let's go just quickly fill that section of the map in. 
I like the the uh, 3D scrolling effect they've got. Yep. On this. Uh, well, Supercast 4 did something similar. Oh yeah, there's a room here. But with more seven. Base Lord, which is oh, terrible. that's another sword and sword from Dark Cloud. Mm -hmm. It's also a sword from quite a few of the other Castlevania games where you have inventory control. Yeah. Anyway, um. Yeah, we're about done. Uh, yeah. Can you get to a save point? Yeah. I'm all cut uh, off from here. Actually, actually thinking about it, I should probably just double back. Well, should we uh, let's end it here and pick up? Yeah. Well, okay. We're yeah. gonna. Okay. Having good games. I'm rewind. I'll see you next one. Bye bye. bye.